there. I had not anticipated that this would this would make exactly ten minutes. I expected I would have like just a bit of song left in the middle of the ten minutes, but this is just just ten minutes. Whoa. I am flabbergasted. Anyway, there's not a single individual coming here, it seems. I have two viewers. Are they real people? Are they bots? I don't know. Can I, what can I check? I keep getting followers. I have 21 followers now. What? Now can I come to oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Someone came and I can't see who that is because I am outside of the stream, of course. Perfect timing. Um, I see it's that kind of purple. Purple individual. Just give me one second. Ah, there. Yo! Salut, Termi. Salut, salut. So back to studio mode now that now that I have the chat on the phone. Um, oui. <laughs> Alors, sur l'ordinateur, t'es en violet. Sur l'hôtel, t'es en gris. C'est fascinant. Anyway, guys, I'm gonna scroll stream two. Uh, so first of all, I would I would just take one second. That just came up because I launched stream. I launched Steam. Um, okay, you know what? You're not gonna see anything um, particularly particular I will show you my screen my screen J oh you again what I don't know I don't know anyway I will exceptionally oh wait screen okay so Transition to screen. You see everything. You can see the entirety of my mess. Now the thing is, I open Steam and I see this because the yeah, Scrolls Online is getting a new. Um, is it just a chapter? Is it an entire chapter? Is it just a new array? I think it's a whole chapter. It's a bit complicated, but so you see, I see this. And this uh, pertaining to all of this, so of course I click to pre-order. Like, whoa, okay. Oh, that's getting private. The thing is, if you scroll down and all, uh, it's the base game, the extension. If you wanna pre-order it, is well, forty-one bucks, 40, almost forty-two bucks. They missed an an occasion, so. This has made me extremely sour. What the fuck? At what point do you believe this is an acceptable way to present your information? Like, the big word on here is Necron. 
limited offer mount and familiar fr for free and this and um, I, I just what what that's egregious anyway let me transition to oh <laughs> it does that um, we are not starting in 10 minutes we're just starting once I eat the entire screen capture uh, anyway I mean you will have to live with a countdown even though we are not counting down anymore so yeah there's that but yeah new chapter coming to the Elder Scrolls Online eventually I didn't really follow things I have been you know managing the things that have had been not managed until I was given the gift of retelling. So things have been a bit hect hectic because uh, there was a tiny scare. Actually, one because there's been an update, of course, today. Today was update day on the other screens online and one person in a guild that joined on my main character uh, lost their entire settings like it all went back to default and I, on my end there's one thing that did change I don't know why but globally it was okay so I, I, I also had that scare and I had to check my settings <laughs> so that was fun uh, so I suggest we just go in without further ado. Me transition back to game. Yes, the game. Actually, we can skip these, which is cool. So, last time I did try and give um, a very, very, very confused. Um, Introduction to the entirety of the Elder Scrolls series. Um, I think I will go back on that and just give you little snippets of things that may be important to know. Um, but not tonight because I could not prepare stuff. Yay! Um, I have prepared stuff like a countdown, which is great <laughs> for the stream. <laughs> I have other stuff to prepare. I might already have the games launched next time I do stuff because I found out how to, you know, separate the different audios of the of like various things on the the from the computer instead of having my microphone, computer, everything from the computer. So yes, just a little uh, it's not a preview, it's like the inverse of a preview, like last time on the adventures of Bing Bong, the magical cat. So we made the Bing Bong, you can see him. He's beautiful, isn't he? He's entirely covered in armor. Um, actually, I could toggle off the helmet. That's one thing I will do. Uh, and we cre so recreated Bing Bong. And we woke up in some cell. Uh, we were greeted by a researcher from Clan Durini who told us we are on the Isle of Balfira 
uh, we somehow arrived there through some weird dimensional thing that mysteriously opened uh, and let out, well, bing pong. And it did wreak atrocity. So she just grabbed us and put us away on, in a cell for everybody's safety, and we are now making our way to the mean Daedric thing to fix the island because everything's a bit of a mess at the moment. We picked a weapon, we thoroughly sacked a, an armory, and that's about where we are at right now. And all that happened besides character creation last time. Now that you know that, let's go. So, um, let's see how this all goes. Um, I will just... okay. You, you calm down, game volume, computer volume in general. What? Why is there so much light? This is... Th this is definitely weird and shouldn't be happening like this. Whoa. Okay, okay, so new t notification crap back. Yes, I know, and you why? You keep pestering us all the time. So there's a. Yo, comment ça va? Okay, this is definitely way too bright. Way, 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 way too bright. What the hell is up with that? So settings, video display for. Uh, shadow quality. Okay, le let's just go with low and apply and <laughs> wait because that takes a lot of time. Lots and lots of time for no reason. Oh! Yeah, I mean, okay, so you see now. What I just don't understand what the hell happened prior to this. Okay, so. What I was saying is, right now I'm on a seven days free trial for for the ESO Plus thing, which means, okay, whoa, okay, why is the game, okay, this is behaving, v the lights are behaving extremely weirdly. Oh, poor thing. I hope she recovers fast. But uh, so th that that's weird. That's with this. I mean, I've been playing earlier today, and things definitely were not that weird. So I mean, we we will go with the flow. We will go with the flow and try and fix this next time like you know not in stream but yeah so ESO plus that means I have access to this thing which is a craft bag which is uh, where all crafting ingredient crafting things will go for now uh, which frees a lot of space oh my god not enough space Yes, I know. I'm aware, game. Yeah, it also doubles spaces for th for th some things and all that. Uh, pewter necklace, <gasps> ornate pewter necklace. That that's nice. Uh, we are full. Uh, well, we have a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. Oh. Yeah, that sounds fine. That sounds okay. She do good. She uh, whoa, okay. So this is where we are going to destroy a lot of things because we are gonna need space eventually for more interesting things. Okay, this is 
Oh. Okay, marked as junk. Which is irrelevant in the grand scheme of things. Traveler's boots and tunics. Destroy, destroy junk. I mean, destroy this. I'm just gonna go to the collections. Yes, I know what this is. Appearance. Hide your helm. Set active. So you can see the bing bong. Uh, now that this is done, let us head out. Oh. Right. The entrance to Kirai's gallery should be east of here. Let's set out. Yeah, eventually. I'm just gonna check. No, I do not have an active mount. I am not surprised. Oh! Okay, so it is account wise. Oh, that's. Wait, okay, so now let's go back to this seat. Oh, haha. -ha. Um, yeah, okay. So, I have a mount. I already have a mount. The free mount you get when you first bring character to level 10 but I already have it and that's nice compass and wall map okay yeah I don't care oh 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 recipe Yeah, 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 I am aware. I think I should stop grabbing all these weapons. But yeah, there's gonna be something very, very interesting there. At some point, eventually. Uh, no, not the ashes. I mean, you gotta check all of these for stuff like recipes and all that because that's always cool to find now if I if I could stop um, automatically grabbing all the weapons like a dumbass yeah decorative wax that's another cool thing um, now I just wonder how exactly things will behave once the spell of free ESO plus um, trial was off. So I have been told, so I, I know that you just keep your things, you just can't add more things until you've freed space. Like, I will have uh, a bazillion inventory slots taken out of 60 and I just can't um, try and add a new slot to that until uh, I have gone back on the oh fuck you golem invoker oh yeah no I'm gonna go up north because uh, first time I went here I didn't go to that building so I'm curious Oh, I should dodge that one. Oh, I mean, targeted by a status effect. What do you mean? Anyway, let us walk probably. Oh, butterfly! 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 Yay! Another thing here? Nothing here. Oh, saber cat. It's gonna try and kill us anyway, so let's go. Boom. Uh, I'm uh, raised. Out of flame increased. What do we have here? Okay, just more stuff to loot.
computer necklace. <gasps> yes, but he's always been mean at family meetings. So we get natural water. I'm not gonna take these. Um, gloves. Hat. Uh, do you wanna draw your lightning staff eventually? That can be fun. Uh, Gauze, jerk, and it's all gonna be the same stats anyway. As the ones I have now. So let us go. Uh, Cups, uh, restoration stuff, lining stuff. Let us grab all the things. Um, I said that and literally right after I grab some equipment without thinking. This, folks, is what is called. High IQ gameplay. Uh. No. Get the hell away. So, anyway, we are going to be sent uh, all over the island. No. Not notice me. Um. So, you may notice that sneaking consumes stamina. Um. Ooh, samurai. Ring. I mean, I just destroy stuff as needed. <laughs> Inventory is full, I mean. Yeah, we'll keep it this that way until. Oh, freak you. Get some gold. Uh. The Kirites Gallery is in here. Let's head inside. Hey, let's do just that. After I have properly planned these ants. Okay, now this. Well, this is upsetting. Is it? Oh! Special revels on Twitch? Oh, yeah! Two nights a night, isn't it? We are the 25th. Okay, so. Expansion theme, but real one under new class. Oh, this is gonna be a new class. But yeah, anyway. Jeffers bones. The surge of magicka created by the portals you came through. Uh, must have cracked this sky shard. 
Without a functioning sky shard, this gate remains locked, and there's no way for us to proceed. Damn. Unless you have a set of enchanting tools and a working knowledge of meteoric empowerment theory, no, no. there's nothing for it. We need to find a replacement. I saw one in a vault just south of here a few days ago, but it was flanked by one of the island's more powerful golems. Normally, I'd say we should search for another option, but given the circumstances, I think we have to risk it. Alright, let's find that sky shard. Can I ask you something before we set out? Of course. Let's not tarry too long, though. Okay, so wait. What all Giant sky shards? Giant of meteoric glass. They fall from Aetherius, charged with raw and very potent magic. Mages use sky shards in all kinds of rituals and experiments. We Dureni use them as a power source. So Aetherius is another plane of existence where the gods res reside. That, that's the short of it. What? Okay, this game is a mess. Like. I don't get what is a count one and what is not and why and that that's a mess. But anyway, my god I don't get that did you see near the sky shot? It's a monstrous sentinel called a gargoyle. I've never seen one fight, but by all accounts they are far more powerful than the golems we faced thus far. Okay. Okay. So anyway <laughs> the urns. Okay. No no no. Good, good, good. No. Um. Uh, um. Oh yeah, that, that that's right. I had tried moving my phone here. Okay, here, and it is much better. I can see y'all much better. So, um, pewter rings no. Ash, ash. I mean, it might seem long to you, but you wouldn't believe the amount of recipes I found in there. And that's... That helps you save so much money. Because you can buy some recipes, not all. First of all, not, not all recipes are have to be bought at NPCs. And um, I mean, even those that are there, I mean, it, get ex it does get expensive. Uh, which shouldn't really be an issue given how much money I've been making on my other account and the fact that I can leave money on the in the bank to grab with any other character but uh well so say very this is preferred this is not so many ashes I'm gonna literally get rich, rich off ashes. That's fantastic. Um, Who's Pansash? Clear water. And okay, so that's it for here. Let's see. Huh? here somehow oh my god it would be so great if I could find some damned seaweed I won't find any here but I 
gonna find some eventually. Um, because I need that for a recipe for some daily quest on my other account, and I'm you know the character, but uh, it's so frustrating because somehow when it, I was having you know inventory issues on my adventures, I just kept running into seaweed, and I couldn't use it. Because I had one recipe that required it, and I didn't have the other ingredient that went with it. So, no cooking with seaweed, no, no use for seaweed. And now I have a daily quest that requires me to use some seaweed. I keep dropping the other ingredient of that recipe but not a single piece of seaweed in sight and that's very frustrating I stab restoration stuff um, okay I think oh, oh, lock pick. I have so many lock picks now I'm gonna pick Octolock all the locks. Do you see that vault to the south? The sky shot is there. All right. I see a nun to the south. It is empty. Okay, I mean, then let's go. Um, whoops. Okay. Who sees me? Is it? Ah, uh, and is it not aggressive like in Skyrim? <laughs> They're just gonna give you a heart attack by detecting you all of a sudden. Oof! Yeah, I don't mind mud, mud crabs in this game. They're nice. They're nice. I don't know what happens between year 200 something of the second era, so right now, and um, is it the fourth or the fifth era? All of a sudden, I just have a bit of a doubt. But yeah, I don't know what happened between now and Skyrim for them to become so violent. Nordian way. There you are. Uh, let's look at the urns. Yes. No. No recipe. I mean. There had been a recipe. Well, maybe I should go in fast so we can have some help. Excuse me. While we deal, okay, no, we are alone here. There it is, the sky shard. Yeah, um, and there it is, the fucking thing that will mess us up. So for the fight. No. Okay, so I do remember this fight being a bit more difficult and a bit more daunting. Oh, I can't take this one. So I will get rid of this here pewter ring. Yeah, yeah, th th that sounds like it. Well fought. Grab the sky shot and let's get moving. Yay! 
Let's go back to this view because it's much nicer. So, Sky Shard, maybe it is in the Narn. <laughs> Um, no. Um, you won't give me any damn recipe anymore, will you? More height braces. Lock pick. Empty urn, empty urn. Oh, <laughs> there it is. The sky shard. Outside of a nun. Who would thought? Who would thought? Did you just absorb the energy of that shard? Not quite what I intended, but we can work with this. Let's head back to the gate. Nam. <laughs> we just went to the game shard and went nam. No. One of these days, I will interiorize the notion of checking before trying to grab things. Ugh. So, no, earn, earn, earn. It's mine, no weird. weird. No bond, not weird. What? Uh, oh, okay, so no more earns. Earns, they are all empty. looks so much like um, backpacks, which you can find later in the game, that are just advanced urns. I mean, I don't know if they are advanced, it's the same thing as urns. And I keep wanting to click on the hats, like, oh, what does this backpack contain? Nothing, it's not a backpack, it doesn't contain things. So. Outside we go. Um, now let's go back up. That was another another thing that. Hmm. Do we? Do we? Do we not? No, no. Let, let's not do that. Let's just go ahead. Go forward. Go. Oh no! 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 Another lion. And you are empty. Yep. <laughs> the backpack was alive. <laughs> yeah. So. Oof. I thought this was gonna be an enemy. Oh. There's just another dude behind us. Some barley. Okay, wait. Now that I am here, that we do not have any skill points up right now. Oh, urns. Searchable urns. Um, maybe I will move forward instead of doing this. Case in point. Hmm, maybe I'll stop. Continues anyway. 
I may have a looting addiction problem. But it's not my fault if game developers put things in their urns. Okay, let us bath the energy back into these sky, ch sky shards. Ha! You did it! Let's speak for a moment. Where are you? Okay. I'm afraid we've reached the release. You are so correct. The Daedric creature responsible for all these portals waits just beyond that gate. If you have any other preparations to make, make them now. No. <laughs> huh? Do you have any advice on how to slay this thing? Again, I'm just a scholar, but I'd encourage you to remember what we practiced before. Keep moving, strike true, and exploit any opening the creature gives you. Thanks for being useful, Norian Wim. Um. I didn't expect any less from a great um, scholar of the Dyrony clan as you. Uh. So let's kill some monstrosity from hell. There it is. Send it back to oblivion. Yeah, she did. That's right. Wither and die. No, you. You cannot kill what cannot die. I mean, I can try. No, you. Stop being annoying. Just die. Thank you. You did it. So I got the hell in my place. Follow me. No, I have loot to get. Oh, let us claim the rewards. One attribute pearl, one skill point, and yep, exactly. Uh, my inventory is full. I can't get the uh, useless thing that I'm not gonna use anyway. This one is moderately better, so let's do this. Let me see. Okay, so we have a lot of light armor. Moderate armor, we have a lot more. Uh, okay, let's get rid of this. Okay, so. Claim. And <laughs> now here comes the time. So, um, I didn't quite think, th uh, I, am, I mean I entirely forgot about that part of the plan until now. Let me just check. So everybody is, most people have agreed, yes, hi YouTube, and <laughs> let me just <laughs> put something up real quick, because you all, uh, I mean, basically everyone agreed to just vote on things. Um, we are not a lot of people right now. Uh, I think it's just you now. 
who's in the chat at the moment? Because if, if it's just one or two people, I might just not have to run after something to make pause. Anybody alive in the chat? Yes. So where do I put the point? Magica, health, or stamina? For the first part. And then let us look at the skills. <laughs> So as for skills that are open for grabs, we have Searing Strike, it's Magicka for the Magic Cat. That's fair. And now, what do we get? We have um, Spiked Armor. Release your inner dragon to gain major resolve, increasing physical spell resistance, and while activity ammo returns, flame damage. So, you hit yourself if you try to hit me. You in melee range. Okay. But the choice is Earth and Heart, uh, skill line, Stone Fist. Crush the earth beneath you, dealing a lot of damage to all enemies around and stuff flies around you and if you activate again it just launches all the debris but then that weapon force shock focus on the mental energy staff and blast an enemy for flame damage and shock damage and frost damage uh, armor stuff we are heavy armor people so, increase armor for reasons and craft, uh, we can't. So, do I spike the armor? Do I bound on the ground or do I go and be magical with my, s extra magical with my staff? Force shock sounds cool. Yeah. And in line with Bing Bong being the greatest knight of all of Tamriel with his very knightly um staff. Quick slots. No, I don't need to use quick slots for now. Oh yeah, I mean I could use it for that. Eh. Okay, more stats for two hours. I'm gonna use it to get it out of the way. Um, okay, so there are no... No... Oh yes, now it's gonna be story time. Because look at this! Bookshelves! And urns. It's a bookshelf. What do we have here? The Feast of Saint Calicia the First. Yep, Th that's very correct. Um, do we do we read the things or not? I mean, I'm just gonna do this to grab the eventual skill point that may be tucked between pages. I hold the stars. Look at the central column. I had no idea it was concealing something like this. Let's get a closer look. Hello. Why do we have goddamn DNA in here? In the column. 
lockpick. Right. Well, oh, this makes sense. I mean, I just wish we could like have a library or something like, you know, collection or at home or something like. I mean, I have a bookshelf. I don't know how to populate it. With my main character. Uh, top of bay. What this? What this? Wines of black wood. You never. I do this because you never know where you're gonna get um, a skill level up. God, let's. I didn't learn my lesson. Paris of top of it again on wild cast stones. Okay, no, no, I'm gonna read this one because I have okay a work of recording knowledge from the mine and devoted research of scholar Ferren Frenle of the Major Guild. As have normal names challenge. For some, for more rudimentary information on the astral geological devices. Discuss heroine, consult ethereal fragments, a book by fellow scholar Lady Cinnabar of Taneth. As you may well know, the Wildkind Stones are laid devices of great and, as of yet, unknown capabilities. The stones are commonly sought after as sources of great thaumaturgic power. Not much can be said as, a, as to their origin, other than that multiple Accounts exist to suggest that the stones themselves fell to Tamriel. Huh. Where they came from, or what their purpose was, or if there was any purpose to the stones at all before the elites recovered them is unknown. Yeah, I know. Uh, what can be said, though, is that these stones have been used since the time of their first recorded landing to assist great mages with their work. What kind of stones are blue in color and were fixtures of the great elite cities? Since the time of the elite's fall, the stones have been gathered and used for all manners of personal gains or ends. Which is not to say that the stones have any ethical leanings. They remain, and we forever be, stones. It is worth noting that there is a type of Welkind stone that will not be discussed at length in this book. This is because a lot of is known and yet also remains shrouded in mystery about the dark Welkind stone. These variants seem to specifically store magic of a purely destructive kind. Wait, wait, I was not, I was thinking of something I was while reading. Like, how did I keep reading but not thinking? Okay. <laughs> No, 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 yeah, but the dark work of stone, there's one, there's no spell, magic, perilous, kind, without prompting, they have exploded, destroying countless researchers and treasure hunters <laughs> who join in into the elite cities on expeditions to recover technologies and works. It appears as though the elites, the dark work of stones, has an added layer of defense. Being so volatile, these stones are well known by expedition parties, but have not been studied in a contained settling. In short, they have never made it back to schools, laboratories, or places of study intact. Wow, go figure. A literal magic bomb? Not staying intact? What a surprise! What kind of great work in stones? On the other hand, have been studying at grand length and a completion of that knowledge can be found within these pages. Grand. So the thing is, um, I mean, I don't know with um, this path here, we are gonna walk. But. My magic is rejected. <laughs> yeah, I mean. Ancient elves invented the A bomb. Wow.
So I am not gonna venture there. This is the key rights gallery. Perhaps uh -huh. I remember it. Uh what do you mean? Was everything closed when you came? Now I see why we never managed to unlock the gates. Their power comes from this arcane helix. Amazing. With the helix exposed, these gates can finally reopen. Perhaps not all of them at first, but enough to reach most of Tamriel. The question for you, I suppose, is where to first? Yeah, yeah, um... I'm gonna go back to reading stuff, okay? Okay. No. Nye. Kaka. Okay, I think this is where we came from. Hello, I mean. Um, good luck while being stuck at work. Um, so we bashed things and decided big. <gasps> decided big mo would indeed um, make great use of his staff of destruction. Oh. Oh, well, that's nice. Mm. What do you? Oh, no bone. Yum yum. So, what do we have here? How come we got her tail? I don't care. Wait. To link. Oh. It's Argonian, okay. We have a resolute, I don't care. Whoa, I'm so unlucky. I know I got one or two skill books the first time I came here. Where's the other righteous? Um, not a single skill book? Whoa, that's. Right. Okay. Fine. Oh, whoa. Would you look at the time? It's late o'clock. Uh, now, very correct question. Where is that from? Stripe Sench Tiger. It's a mount. Oh, it's not something we can have anymore. <laughs> what does this lead to? Oh, I think that's Clenumbra. I think that's Dug of Covenant one. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Anyway, uh, let us let us talk to Noria. Can you believe this? Just look around. With yeah, I don't know what I was hoping for. The chamber is positively crackling with magic. The Keyrite's gallery has come to life, and I finally think I know why. Why do you mean? Because of you, matters in Tamriel are bleak. War rages in Cyrodiil. Daedric princes conspire. Dragons ride the winds of elsewhere. The second era needs a savior. I believe the gallery. Perhaps even the adamantine tower itself chose you. I know the self-consciousness of the second era needs a savior. I mean, in, in the second era, that's okay. In the first era, that would be weird. It would be so weird to have people of the first era go like, Yeah, we are living in the first era. <laughs> what do you think I should do next? The Keyrites Gallery opened doors to every corner of Tamriel. Places, I suspect, that desperately need a hero's aid. This choice is yours to make, but wherever you choose to go, I'm sure adventure awaits. 
May the stars protect you. Oh, we already unlock Soul Magic. But I can't complete the quest because I don't have inventory space. Yeah, you can also buy, answer by at any point. And that's absolutely fantastic. Mm, okay, so armor, but medium armor because I have so much more. Belt. The key rides gallery. Yay. So, have you chosen where to go? What region of the world strikes your fancy? Not everyone gets to pass instantly from one side of Tamriel to another, you know. <laughs> this is quite a gift. Do you plan to use one of the doors as, wo as well? What me? No, I've got work to do. The Cinderella will want every bit of this place searched and studied. Since I did the discovering, I'll probably end up leading the effort. Adventure abroad sounds all well and good, but my place is here. Well, damn. That's a lot of fun. I've not chosen one case here. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh, so, do you really think fate brought me here? Well, fate's sort of a clumsy way to put it. No offense. Honestly, we may never know why you were chosen, but I believe there was intention here. Something, whether it be the stars, the gallery, or the tower itself, placed you here for a reason. And Chisel? What brought it here? Perhaps it followed you to prevent you from reaching your... Well, destiny sounds a bit too grandiose. Let's just say to stop you from reaching your potential. Then again, maybe the power of this place brought you here to stop Chisel. I guess we'll never know. Probably not, but what's a life without unanswered questions, right? Boring, if you ask me. I think you ever run rival the mysteries of this place. Ha! Huh, an elf can hope. Answering that question will probably keep me occupied for the next hundred years. Is the helix connected to the adamantine tower? How does it perceive distant corners of Tamriel? I may never understand it, but I'll do my best. So the adamantine tower is the huge tower on this island here we are on right now. So. Any thoughts on why I should go? It is a bit overwhelming, isn't it? The whole of Tamriel is stretched out before you. We could start with the political considerations. Three great alliances vie for control of Cyrodiil. Does the fate of the Pact, Covenant, or Dominion interest you? So I was suggesting really just going for one of the alliances. Uh, but eh. It's really not that important. We could go straight to Ezware. I don't blame you. Interprovincial intrigue is the basis of my whole profession. And even I find it tiresome after a while. I suppose that widens the map a bit. What else can I find adventure? Well, as I said before, threats to Tamriel have grown like weeds practically everywhere. Would you prefer to spend time among my elven kin, the Khajiit of elsewhere, or men of the north and south? <sighs> we all are going to do go there eventually. We are, but no, nobody wants to spend time among your elven kin, not young way. Especially not Khajiit. Um, so for anyone who's not entirely aware of the Elder Scrolls series, everybody is s fucking racist. Except um, wood elves that are cannibals apparently, that's a toxic trait. Um, Khajiit um, are whimsical. Let's put it that way. And also excellent teeth. Um, and who else is problematic in a way that is not racist? Or someone else who's not extra racist. Um, yeah. Yeah. I don't know. It's a bit weird. But yeah, so everybody is racist in this. 
but the high L's just pushed that to the extreme. Uh, <laughs> I had to rush through um, some high elf places for some reasons and ooh, I was not expecting that much racism. <laughs> okay, so we already they, at that time the Thalma already exists, so yeah, it's pretty bad. Obviously it's put in a way that is meant to be criticized. Um, a lot of the Elder Scrolls, from what I have seen, are about how oh, maybe um, the world would be a better place if people could take each other a little bit more, you know, and stop being jerks out of principle. But yeah, no, I don't, I don't, I don't want that. No, the only way. Nobody wants that. What are you talking about? Um, so basically, uh, since we are a Kajit, I could suggest two things. Either we do the alliance. I mean, we're gonna do it all anyway, in the end, eventually. So either we do alliance stuff and. Yeah, I mean, alliance stuff. So in our case, it would be Admiral Dominion. Uh, so we would be uh, with all the Khajiit, High Elves and Wood Elves and dealing with their issues or we could hack off to elsewhere which is the native Khajiit uh, land of the cat folk is in sorry shape Imperial holdouts sit upon the throne and a rage of dragons spilled out of the halls of Colossus burning everything in their path if it's adventure you seek you'll find it there So, getting treated badly by extremely racist people, or um, Skyrim, but in the desert, and everybody is cats. What shall we do? The path is for adventure. Oh, realms of many mentioned. One of these gates up here to go to Western Skyrim, a mystical kingdom of Nords led by King Svargrin. The other leads to Blackwood, at the southern tip of Sirgul. Imperial remnants rule there. Okay. Oh, it's alright. So, um, basically, I was saying. We can go wherever none of this matters, but um, since we are a Khajiit, we have two um, more prominent choices. Either we do the Alliance stuff uh, as intended like from the base game, so we go to the of Mary Dominion or we go to Elsewhere uh, that's apparently getting um, assaulted by dragons so it's Skyrim but in the desert and everybody is cats Got Blackwood, I don't know what Blackwood does So I will just look at all the options. High Isle, that's the latest chapter. It's in Elven territory, like original Elven territory. So, I don't know. Kathy Roost, that's our um, alliance one, I think. Source Mackay, it's Nagafal Covenant alliance. So it's a base game. Lake Rock Isle, um, that's an island. Um, off the coast of Skyrim, it's no stuff. Vardenfell is also from a DLC. It's dark elf stuff. So if you want to contend with Deidre, you'll get some Deidre. Western Skyrim, 
Western Skyrim. It's Skyrim. You should get what it is. Somerset Isle. Elven stuff. But that's also, that's also where I had one of my fave characters. So I'm showing you options <laughs> as to where to go. Because I kinda wanna go... I mean, we'll do all of that stuff eventually. Eventually. Oh, oh there's nothing up there. Nothing yet up there. So... I would say... I would say... Rather, either the Almeri Dominion stuff, or... Uh, as where. What do you say? Base game, Almeri Dominion stuff? As where DLC or another DLC or thing that might have piqued your interest. Okay, and there's nobody else right here with us to save us from this torment. So let us flip a coin, maybe. Uh, oh wait, no, no, let me... Yeah, it sounds intriguing. And in all honesty, um, we are less likely to get discriminated discriminated against because I mean we got the Daggerfall Covenant we got the Ebonheart Pact we got the Aldmeri the Minion right? <laughs> that sets the tone but also I'm just wondering if we wouldn't get um, some more hardcore and not beginner friendly lore in these places. I mean in, in elsewhere. But ah uh, well. So have you chosen where to go? What it is a bit overwhelming, isn't it? The whole I don't blame you. Interprovincial instincts. So well, as that. I said before, threats to Tamriel have grown like weeds practically according to our spies, the land of the catfolk is in sorry shape. Oh, you have to do all the things. The throne, and a rage of dragons spilled out of the halls of Colossus. So this is what's everything in their path. If it's adventure you seek, you'll find it there. Mention the elves if too. you take the gates of Vardenfell, you can meet the Dark Elves, and maybe even their god king, Vivek. You could also travel south to Somerset Isle, our ancestral home and the primary seat of power for the High Elves. And also the place of the dwelling of Razumdar. Well, Always. Though the natives don't make it easy. High Elves of Somerset don't share the Dorenis' pragmatism. They're often too proud to ask for help. But our agents reported some strange activity around the Crystal Tower. It's probably worth a look. Imperials in the Kajit country? No, 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 that's not what Certainly. I said. One of these gates appear to go to Western Skyrim, a mystical kingdom of Nords led by King Svargrin. The other leads to Blackwood, at the southern tip of yeah. Sirius. Imperial remnants rule there. Yeah, so basically Imperials just got ousted of Cerudil like hard, and apparently there's some Imperials that remain there. The Nords of Western Skyrim are inhospitable, to put it lightly. Even so, we've been able to glean a few things. I've read reports about increased vampiric activity in the region. Never a good sign. Nope. They need stout adventurers to deal with it. If you take the gates of Vardenfell, you can meet the Dark Elves, and maybe even the no, Vardenfell was Squeezing out. information out of the Dark Elves is delicate business, to be honest. We know far less about what's going on in Morrowind than we should. I can tell you that Vivek put out a summons for heroes recently. Uh, That's worrying. Friends of Man, so, Blackwood. Our agents are investigating a handful of strange Daedric structures hidden away in the swamps near Gideon and Leowin. I honestly couldn't tell you how they got there, but the presence of Daedric anything in Tamriel <laughs> is always cause for concern. Okay. Excellent. 
You can visit Sros Makai in Daggerfall Covenant territory, an island called Kanathi's Roost that the Aldmeri Dominion set its eyes on, or the Ebonheart Pax Domain. Hmm. Okay, I mean... Oh, so I didn't necessarily need to talk to, uh, to her for all that. So... Right, right. So, do we stick to northern as well? Or do we go somewhere else? Much longer than this, because yeah, as where. Let's go. This portal leads to elsewhere. The home of the cat folk is well worth visiting, especially in light of recent events. Reports indicate that dragons re-emerged there. Dragons? Hard to believe, but it's true. The Khajiit could definitely use your help. Yeah, let's do that. Jaws, claws as long as grain size and wings so wide they blot out the sun. What it did not eat, it burned. Dragons are bad enough, but undead tend to go on without any. We will hunt these necromancers down and end this dragon. The usurper queen feels secure in Rimi. Why come to me about the dragons? We're about to change that. What happens next is your own fault. I suggest you go and bow before Queen Euraxia, before she has you thrown to the dragons. <laughs> All right. Okay, Queen. Okay. So I have an auditorium discovered. Okay. So. <laughs> In retrospect, that might have been a bad idea, because this is gonna uh, assume we know things. So this is definitely just more of an advanced player thing. I shall keep this in mind for the eventual, you know, um, actual law exploring run of ESO that's coming in the distant future. <laughs> No messing around with that. And also, now we have a skill point. Do we have new things? Oh, yes. So, we have Searing Strike. Slash an enemy with flames, dealing a lot of damage, and damage over time. And burning. Okay. Dragonic power, so. Spiky armor, stone fist, so area of the mage and throwing things. Armor, destruction stuff. We got wall of elements. Slam your stuff down, create an element bar in front of you. It's not really a barrier, it's more like an area in front of you that's magically being lit. And it the element of it depends on your staff. So one second tick for the damage uh, and some effects depending on your staff. Um, um, heavy armor, we got resolve, steel and constitution. Health recovery and Magic and 7 recovery when you take the mage every 8 seconds. Well, we got some magic, but we can't put skill points in here. So, damage over time, spiky armor, area of damage, 
or Wall of Elements. What do you say, Black Roses? That's honestly a lot of... The Constitution... Oh, I mean I don't have one of these, I just got a skill point uh, because I was awarded a skill point by the by the quest. It didn't level up. It's a stone fist. Stone fist. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, so that's it for today. I'm just gonna run a few errands with you as we wrap up. But for next time, I'm definitely gonna have to think of how to organize that, like grouping class and weapon or armor or other and first vote on that with the people and then within each group what do we do because eventually we're gonna have more things to vote about even within just the, the armor stuff and all that so as of as for now oh are you kidding me are you kidding me yes this is bing bong and this is gonna come to an end <laughs> i'm sorry okay i mean what is this can we can we start having a deptorium how far? Okay, it's not far. There's a dragon just over there. Do we just... Okay, so I can call the horse. Yay! Do we try and go near the dragon? What are you? Oh my god. I wanna try the dragon. For fancies. Thank you, Rob. No good can come of that place. What do you mean? This looks like a Rob. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Jesus Christ. We are so gonna die. Send back and oh, and we left up. Destroy. I would just make space. Destroy. Okay. Hey, I got everything. This was definitely a uh, mistake. 
any queen or dragon killer. <gasps> like, look, I'm so low level. Okay, so, um, what do I want to do? What are you? You are definitely going to be hostile. And I'm having none of that. Okay, are you a merchant? Are you a merchant? That, there, there's no merchant. Okay. Star Haven Way Shrine. I mean, I could Way Shrine myself to a place with a merchant and a banker. And a bag merchant, because that's what I want right now. Why am I running? I have a horse. No, is sealed from the other side. Ugh. Why are you like this? Why are you like this? We should go in for Kanathi Roost. I mean, it's not too late. It really isn't. I don't like how this was managed. We don't get a. Oh, there's another dragon. There's a. Oh! We can go to Riemann. Okay, okay, okay. Let's do this. Fast travel network. I know. You don't really need to know. Not yet. I mean, it's not. It's not lore. Yep, yep, yep. So, I don't care. Bring me to the marketplace. So, I'm just gonna deal with the inventory stuff. <laughs> okay, yeah, 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 true, true. Level 4 rewards. Um, let me see. Raymond discovered. Home goods furniture. Oh, there's a pack merchant. That's what I want. Uh, what do we get? Uh, has all the stations ever over there? Let's go. That's kind of what I want. So there's gonna be merchants there too. Anyway, so let me let me let me let me. Let me Itonda, who are you? Blue, then Tonic too. Mix it all up and see what happens. Well, why not? You'll never learn anything if you're too scared to try. Shut up. Who thought this was a good idea? That's Dragon's pellet. Oh, okay. For oh, high node bones. And this here. Pewter necklace. Okay, wait. How much did I sell? All the ashes. Okay, it's one piece. Okay, so F. Let's go and claim it. Um, I mean, arm legs. Since we are going heavy armor, we will do this another time. Yeah, I don't know. So, on legs. Okay, so let's. Destruction stuff. What do we have? We have the same thing but lightning. Eh. Do you want to do lightning damage instead of fire damage? Tell me why I look at the armor options. Whip. So, and gauntlets, the same. I'm good, I got the 
non intricate ones okay I mean Both, this is my instinctive response. I mean, later on we can do that. I mean, that would be this one for now, marginally so. Eh. Let's do that. The consumables, we have this <laughs> half digested adventurous backpack. Once these health supplies for an adventure are just hitting the trail, now it holds supplies for you. Oh. Oh. Can I take this much? We have shredded. <laughs> okay, what's in this? Two sour gems, carrot soup, homespun rub of health. Not for me, but shredded pants, which is a treasure. These simple cotton pants are ripped to shreds, seemingly from powerful legs tearing through the fabric. Right above werewolf musk oil. Perfume distilled from the musk of a werewolf. Some use it as a fragrance of other others was as a way to avoid prowling werewolves. I, um, excuse me? Shredded bones shredded by powerful legs, tearing through it, well with werewolf musk oil, um, 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 I am speechless. Oh, inventory is full. Uh. Okay. 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 Not okay. Not okay. So I don't necessarily want to get into um, crafting with this character. Okay, so you know what? Actually, I'm gonna go to the bank. So th that's the thing I should be doing. Yeah, I'm. Uh, I'm curious about the choice of choice here like <laughs> whoa okay um haha -ha. um whoa okay so where am i okay, well okay there's where god cat's bow counting house which is the bunk um, I mean, knowing them, they definitely knew what they were doing. I do not tolerate sticky fingers in my bank. Once your valuables have been secured, that is where they will stay. Um, what if I want to take them back? What, wh what if? I'm just asking, Slurra. Yeah, she has a nice dress. I mean, all of my items. What? What? What do you mean? Can, but what? 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 Okay, 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 okay. okay. So the bunk is not shared among characters. The bunk is not shared among characters. What is that? What what is up with that? I okay. So I assumed the bunk was well, I mean, uh just as as I just said, shared between characters. So I would have been able to slap stuff at it. 
Um, turns out we can't quite do that, so... I will just head back to the... What, what are you talking about here, Black Roses? Like, what, what, what is it that I didn't know but I probably should have known? So let's head back to I am eh short of path. The weather I don't get it. Working station oh. Cassettes. Uh Creation, uh, I don't care. I wanna, uh. Okay, nothing here I can. Alright. Let us find literally anything else. <gasps> I'm stupid. I should have taken the money from the bank. Like smithing station, yeah, um. Research, do I have research I can make here? What do you mean there's nothing I can research in this? Okay. But I know I have researchable items. Okay. Mm. Would it be. Okay. Tailoring. Tailoring. Loving station. Research. Oh, yeah. Researchables. This is interesting. Anyway, what do we have here? Mundane's magics. Enchanting. Mm, let's not see. I'm I'm dumb. Okay, so I was running around for stuff to research to free space in my inventory. I don't need it. Because anyway, once I deconstruct things, they will just go to... The... What's it called? Um, materials bag. Yay! That's good, um, like roses. So, that's done. I don't need more information about stealing, game. Okay, so this is... Alchemy, I'm not gonna alchemize stuff. Woodworking, I just did that. Now, I'm gonna have a lot of stuff to deconstruct here. Maybe which I mean just about everything. <laughs> so this is an intricate thing. It basically gives you more XP for destroying it, deconstructing it. Deconstruct all that and whoop. A bit of a bummer that. Okay, oh, first. First. Let me finish this. So, let's take these. Sergeant. Oh, Inferno stuff. That's even better. Okay. Leggings, but it's light. I don't care. Inferno staff, yay! Uh, 
let's go back to these here. No, construct. Oh, no, no, this is researchable. And now I need the clothes. Yes, yes. Clothing station. Research. Okay, we are already researching. So the construct. What was that? Training, training. Oh, I only need one. Wait. No, I think one was light and the other was medium. Oh no. Oh well. Jewelry station in this jewelry crafting station. Yeah, should be somewhere in here, but where exactly I know not. Woodworking station. Okay, this is the blacksmithing station. Can't find the skeleton. Anymore. Oh, I hope no one's hurt. This one shudders to think of the damage the beast could do. Um, I don't care. Tell me where is the jewelry station? This is no, this is the enchanting table. Ugh. I have cooking fire. Ugh. Anyway. Let's not get started on our adventures yet. Uh, this is... Oh. Oh. Oh? Ah, no. I mean, I might just decide to move the thing to... to the Admiral Dominion thing because this is confusing. I didn't know how to enter. I don't know where to start. What is going on anyway? Uh, oh yeah, no. I will just do one thing. It's uh, to locate the stables. You will see why there's there's this one thing, uh, so I will. Whenever I, yeah, I play, I will always stop near stables. Oh, there's this moment, one person please. here. Oh, Basdal. Basdal has been confined in Rimen for far too long. He needs open fields to stretch and run. Instead, he is forced to walk crowded city streets. So that's what I've been mentioning the other time. This is a Kajit, the same as us. The only difference between Pazdal here and Bing Bong there is the phases of the moons, both moons, when they were born. Not parents, not um, region or anything, just Moon phases. Okay, I don't care about this. You're not giving me. Heal. Oh. Alright. So. Right. Outside the city. Oh. Hello, 
Mounts Azura. Don't call us Mounts. Nobody mounts a Sentrat. Riders shut up and follow where we lead, or they land whiskers first in the mud. If you want a mount, go buy a dumb animal. Yeah, they they don't like um getting treated as mounts. But sometimes they will allow people to ride on their backs. But indeed, yeah, I mean they they are sentient people. Sench mounds have just as much of a sweet tooth as a Khajiit. Add a little moon sugar to its meat, and you will have a contented steed. Translation. Put fucking crack in it in their food. And you will have them in your power. That's terrible. Okay, so all so yeah, now the thing is each day you can upgrade a riding skill for two hundred bucks. Um yeah. And then I have a twenty hours countdown. Um And as you may notice, mounts are still quite slow. So, what's gonna happen? Stream die? No, the stream didn't die. Or did it die? Um, I mean, I don't know. I don't think it died. The If the stream died on my end, for me reasons, Oh, well, yeah, I would know. I think I would have issues with the game too. Senchal? Who is Senchal? What? I did not ask for that. Uh, whoa, whoa, okay. So I thought it. I didn't. I, I, I didn't. Oh, okay. That's an entirely different province. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. Um, let me, let me go back to Raymond. No. I saw a guard take a bribe not too long ago. I guess they're fitting into Sencha, such as it is these days. I doubt they'll even bother to defend us against any of those dragons. Useless. Okay, Jesus. Let me go back to Remen real quick. Yeah, that is, I got spooked. Spooked by the thing. But Oh, okay, so each of these used to be kingdoms of their own. Right, so. I will. quit the game right here. And. You're listening to the weekend's greatest hits from Starboy. What the hell? This is terrible. Oh my god, it's so bad. Oof. Ugh. Okay, real music is back. Ugh. That was violent. And you sp I spared you of the worst. I spared you of the worst. I mean, I think normally in theory. <gasps> oh my god. I don't think you realize it was actual bands. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But yeah, it was actual Ben, so hopefully I was quick enough. But I could get flagged for this shit. Uh, stream die, or do I just have awful internet again? That's the last I've seen, and before that, I'm finally going home. This map kinda looks like Europe. Yeah, that was meant to 
be stuff in between um, yeah so anyway that's gonna be it for tonight um, we'll next see each other on Friday for not bing bong I don't know what we're gonna do Ooh, excuse me. I mean, in case of doubt. Uh, oh, that's too bad, Amy. That's too bad. Then it went. Yeah. In case of doubt. Um. Oh no, I know what we could do. There's the new um, Lunar New Year event on Fall Guys. That could be fun. That could be fun. I mean, just in case anybody wants to join, um, Fall Guys is free now. I mean, it got foot ninety-five, uh, so it's free to play at least. <laughs> so we could like bumble about uh, in Fall Guys together on Friday night. That could be fun. But yeah, I think I'm gonna do that because there's a Lunar New Year event over there. And then on Sunday, art stream. I'm finally coming back to life. Uh, and finally having stuff working out and all. So I should finally uh, be able to actually do things. Um, and well that's it for tonight thank you for coming and see you next time